Welcome back to the new layout. If you saw my last video, you'll know that uh, Marksville had a catastrophe here. The tenement district went up in flames and uh, it has now been replaced with a park. Now in real time, those videos were taken just a couple days ago. And I've set this up now for the Memorial Day Parade. Memorial Day is actually tomorrow. I'm filming this on a Sunday. And Memorial Day is actually tomorrow, Monday, uh, the 28th of May, 2018. And this new version of my layout, which is also temporary, just like the last version was, uh, it looks nice. It looks nice with the larger buildings. Prior to this, I had all really small, built right, and other cardboard buildings. These are a little more true to old gauge. But it doesn't matter. They're toys, and that's what I like. So, okay, what do we have? We have a Memorial Day parade, and let's check out some of the vehicles. Now we've got vintage military vehicles from a variety of manufacturers Pyro, Auburn uh, let's see what do we have here Process Plastics, Thomas Toys Peyton I think that pretty much rounds out most everything. Oh there's some marks okay ideal alright Without further ado, let's take a look at what we're going to run. Mark's uh, Canadian Pacific Type 500 Army Supply Train Local with its associated tender. Small bore cannon. Large bore cannon, anti aircraft gun, machine gun, World, World War One outline tank, searchlight, and radio car. Now, the radio car does in fact have the diamond-shaped antenna. However, I can't run it in this configuration on this layout because that antenna sticks up too far and rams into that built-right cardboard signal bridge. Yeah, not a good thing. So, okay. Uh, adapt and overcome. Tell you what, let's get this thing started and see how she runs.